Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will show to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back. And first one, select this background shadow layers. Look here. Then let's select this cat body. Go to solo and move the anchor point down. Clusation tool and select this here. Go to solo and again go to pen behind move the anchor point down clusation tool and select here let's link to body and let's unsolo select this body and press p move to down okay and make new person in frame go to 10 q frames for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down on keyboard and move to up like this, go to 10 Q frame and move to down again. Go 10 Q frame, move to up again, move to down. Select Q frames, make easy or click F9. Let's animation. Okay, so go to first second, hold Shift, press R, open rotation, make rotation Q frame, change first Q frame minus six, and go to here next Q frame, change three. And go to next G frame, change minus one dead five, and next G frame change zero. Select Q frames, make easy, and select all Q frames. Hold Alt, move to right. Let's see. Nice, very good. So in this time, go to first second and select these candies. Select these layer 7, 6, 5, and 4, 3, 2, 1, let's see, okay, and let's press P, make new pass in keyframe, and go to 10 keyframes, move to up, go to 10 keyframes again, move to down, and go to 3 keyframes, 1, 2, 3, move to up little bit, go to 3 keyframes, 1, 2, 3, move to down, Four bones animation. Let's see. Let's select these all Q frames, make easy, and go to graph editor. Let's zoom to graph. Select this middle Q frame, move to left, and select again middle Q frame, move to right. Nice. Okay, so back to Q frames. So we have problem with last three Q frames. Let's select all last three Q frames and right mouse go to Q frame interpolation. Change color settings to linear. Click OK. Nice, very good. And in this time, select this layer six Q frames. Move to right. And this Q frames for layer five. Move to right. I want to random animations. And make like this and these two frames let's see nice and let's select these two frames move to right okay very nice so select all two frames again and let's see timing okay let's move right all these two frames Nice, very good. Okay, so in this time, select these candies. And let's press P. Move to here. Make new pass in Q frame. Go to 10 Q frames. Move to up. And go to 10 Q frames. Move to down. Go to 3 Q frame. 1 to 3. Move to up. Again, 3 Q frames. 1 to 3. Select this Q frame. Copy pass. Select Q frames. Make easy. And select last few frames and go to Q frame interpolation, change linear, click OK, and go to graph editor, select this graph, move to left, and this move to right. Let's see. Nice. So back to Q frames and select all these Q frames, copy, select other candies, go to here, control V, and let's press P, select passing Q frames. Go to last position Q frame 
and move to left this candy and select this layer 9 let's control v for past two frames and press p select position two frames go to last position two frame and move to left okay select this candy and control v press p select position two frames go to again last position two frame move to right and finally select this chocolate and go to first second control v press p select position two frames and go to last position two frame move to right and move to here okay and let's select this layer eight and select first two frame move to left let's see nice so in this time let's select again all two frames and let's the timing let's move to here nice and again make random two frames select this two frame move to right and this move to right like this and this two frames let's see nice very good so in this time let's select this heat layer and let's press air open rotation make rotation two frame let's go to 10 two frames chain rotation and go to here make new rotation go to again 10 two frames change here to right and again go to here make new rotation go to 10 two frames chain rotation zero select two frames make easy ease. let's see nice and go to here first rotation two frame and let's add bones hold shift press p make new passing two frame go to middle and let's go to solo move to down go to next rotation two frame select first position two frame copy pass and make two frames easy this is for bones hit let's see nice select passing two frames copy and go to here Control v for paste and here for paste and select last two frames move to right and select body go to again solo and here let's make better timing make new rotation for body go to here change rotation minus three and here make new rotation for body go to next two frame change three and go to again here make new rotation go to next two frame change zero also let's add positions go to here and make new passing two frame go to middle move it down two two frames go to here select first two frame copy pass select three passing two frames copy and go to here control v and let's hold alt move right select two frames again copy and go to here control v let's see nice very good okay nice so let's unsolo all these layers let's see nice very good let's do full animation okay that's good so let's make background animations select these all layers and close two frame settings and select these clothes all these cloth layers and go to four second press p make new passing two frames go to back and let's make animation let's move to left and this cloth move to left and this cloth move to right and this move to right and this move to left let's see okay nice so select last two frames move to right for more slow animation okay that's good so let's select these all clothes layers and move to behind all layers nice and let's select these bat layers select these bat one bat two and three go to solo and go to 
8 seconds, press P, make new person keyframe, and go to back, select this bet, go to puppet pin 2, let's add one puppet here, one here, and one here. Cool session 2, select bet, press U for C keyframes, and go to 3 keyframes, 1, 2, 3, select this puppet layers, puppet pin 1, we'll change puppet like this, and this for wing animation, go to 3 keyframes, 1, 2, 3, select first keyframes, copy pass, and let's see, nice, and select keyframes, make easies, and let's add expression, hold alt, click time icon, Go to play button, property, and loop out duration. For down expression, click this empty area. And here, puppet pin 1, hold alt, click time icon. Go to play button, property, and loop out duration. So, in this time, select path 1, go to first second, and move to here. Let's animation. Okay, nice. And let's add here some colors. Okay, very good. So let's make some one for other bat layers. Select bat 2 and zoom to here. Go to puppet pin 2. Let's add one here, one, and one here. Click station tool and press U for C active keyframes. And go to 3 keyframes, 1 to 3. Select puppet pin 3 and change wings. Go to 3 two frames, 1 to 3. Select first two frames, copy, past. And make two frames easy. And again, hold Alt, click time icon. Go to play button, property, loop out duration. And for this, again, hold Alt, click time icon, play button, property, and loop out duration. Okay, not bad. So, in this time, select bat 2 and move to down. And here, let's change course. Okay, very nice. So, let's close settings and finally select this bat 3. Zoom to layer. Go to puppet pin 2. Add one puppet here, here, and here. I will make this fast. And let's press U. Go to 3 keyframes, 1 to 3, change wings, go to 3 keyframes, 1 to 3, and copy past keyframes. Make easies and add expressions. And here, puppet pin 2, again, add expression. Let's select bat 3 and press P and move to down or move to here. And let's change course again. Okay. So, we have full animation scene. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.